you guys this is uh the new review of mr blue blazing demon uh we're gonna go ahead and start off and go right into it uh we're gonna go into presentation he gets a four out of five for presentation uh his channel is really well done it's really or it's really well organized uh it's productive and he up he keeps it updated really really recently as you can see he tells you all of his uh channel it shows you all his lps he's done the lp he's working on right now and some that are on hiatus, and some that he'll do in the future series. So he gives you a good amount of, you know, information that you might look. He also updates via Twitter and Facebook. So uh, those are a few things that I wanted to point out. Uh, we're gonna go ahead into the next one. It's uh, video quality. His video quality is at eight out of ten. Uh, there are a few minor. Um, problems or sometimes you'll see in his earlier um, projects the quality isn't as good um, the one that I want to point out the most is uh, Jack and Dexter the quality is a little buff it's a little blurry but he does get a little bit better and that's why I don't deduct him too many points because he does progressively get better quality HD and so on and so forth when it comes to games that are actually supposed to be in HD and in widescreen uh, for, as for audio quality, I gave him 8 out of 10 as well. Uh, there are a few minor audio problems in some of his LPs. Uh, the one that I think I noticed the most was um, Little, Big, Little Big Planet with Mr. Pete Love 69. Uh, he can't really hear Pete for the first 10 episodes. It's like very, he's in the background quite a bit. He does fix it later on, and you do you're a lot able to hear him. Even Blue himself is really really um, soft spoken in that LP. Uh, the music overpowers their voices. Um, so take that into account. That's why he got 8 out of 10 on that. Uh, but for the most part, most of his LPs have good ratio of the music of the actual game and his audio commentary. Uh, we'll go ahead and check that out now. Mark, this area is mine. You'll have to leave quickly now. What? Okay. Uh, change vehicle. Come here. Oh, no, no, don't go away. And I also learned, I was like, there's this one achievement to drop uh, something for 200 blocks really, really fast, and I was like, how the hell am I going to do it? I figured it out. If you if you want to drop fast while flying, you just hit the reverse button, and boom, you hit it. Um, what's on carrier? Um, it's got the, the wings, two propellers, if I had more. So there you go. Uh, it right there it shows you the two two types of commentary he um, commentary he actually has, and the two types that we want I want to get into. I get into consistency later. Uh, personality and commentary. He gets eight out of ten and eight out of ten on both areas. Um, for his commentary, he has two ver types. Uh, he has a very informative type commentary when he comes into games that he's done a hundred percent of the time he knows what the hell he's doing um and that's good to see in games uh, i believe one of them that he does tend to see is uh let's play metroid he knows exactly where he's going no question about it um also goes along with little big planet even though that is a little more on the comedic kind of tide and that's basis on pete loaf with them and their potty humor as i like to call it uh, also, with his Metron Prime series, he knows exactly what's going on. He knows where to get stuff. So, he is a really good walkthrough guide <laughs> with commentary. So, I'm pretty sure you guys will enjoy that. Um, Personality-wise, again, I can't really deduct him that much points because you can't really be that exciting while you do uh, informative LPs. But, he does have a different kind of style, which... I think a lot of people picked up on, and that's why he has as many subs as he has. Uh, he puts emphasis and more passion into what he says instead of just a monotone voice telling you 
um, like reading out of a Game Fact magazine or something. Uh, he puts emphasis into what he says. He puts his own spin on it. He puts his own personality, his own ide- ideas into whatever he's saying. If he has a different way of doing things than the actual guides show you. As for consistency, he got a 4 out of 5. Uh, for the most part, he updates quite frequently, either 3 times a week or 2 times a week. Never, uh, up, doesn't ever really take a week off. If he does slack off a little bit, it'll be one one video a week. But at least knowing that you have one video a week is really, really good. He has had a little, like, times where he kind of didn't upload for a while. But uh, for the most part, it wasn't too big of hiatuses. It wasn't big, big, big. It was like a week or something like that. So I can't give him a perfect score on that end. Uh, he has 4 out of 5, which is still really, really good. Uh, his overall score for this um, review is at 80%. Uh, he did a lot better. He did a little bit better than Sir Cyphron, but uh, he does have a little bit more consistency, and I think that's what's gonna um, uh, lower a lot of scores. Uh, so if you're watching this review, consistency, consistency, consistency. That's what people love. People love watching your LPs, especially if if they're drawn into you with your charm, your personality. And that's why I think a lot of people are drawn into Blue Blazing Demon. His charm and his personality really shine through in his LPs. Uh, as you can see, like I said before, he's at 3,121. Um, so after this review is done, you guys can go ahead and feel free to subscribe. I'll go ahead and put a link in the description. Uh, also, p- please, if you guys wouldn't mind, uh, like the video, comment on it, um, send it to friends, let them know about it. Uh, I would like to get more feedback from you guys, letting me know what I could do better. Um, I'm also going to be taking suggestions on who you guys think I should LP next, or review next, sorry. Uh, I have decided to do reviews every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So, more for you guys to enjoy. Alright, but I think that's about all I have to say about Mr. Blue Blazing Demon. I want to thank you for letting me uh, review you, sir. And I'll see you guys next time. Have a nice day.